react native navigation let's start let's take some time splash screen is open app intro screen is open click on next button or slide click on none button then login screen is open click on sign up button sign up screen is open click on back button click on login button dashboard screen is open we create dashboard screen with bottom tab home profile and setting this also work with the side menu this side menu work with the gestures and button icon so in the side menu we create dashboard user news about and log out click on user user list screen is open click on news then news screen is open click on back back then you can see active tab is setting go to home screen again we try on home screen home screen user user list of news news screen is open about us about us screen is open then click on log out now login screen is open then go press go back button now application is skill again open app next next done go to login screen now click on back button now application will close not navigate to the login screen okay fine so this is the side menu and this is the tab so you can see this also work with the profile so let's start coding part so first you have to install these library splash screen you have to install splash screen library okay then you have to install app intro slider is slider library because we are using hook because we are using functional component that's why we need hook function so you need to install this library react native navigation hooks then install react native navigation and uh, you can link with uh, this finally library installation is done then open your android studio and your project then you create variable folder and save your image then create layout folder and create launch screen layout and pass your image into image view then add some code into your main activity import uh, splash screen library and uh, call this function into on create splash screen function call into the on create if you want to use a style you can also go with this now splash screen task is done now i show code so I use a uh, react native 63.4 version and uh, these are the library which uh, we are using uh, if you use a uh, 
React navigation, then you have to install every library for for drawer navigation, for bottom navigation, and stack navigation. But in this, uh, you just need to install React Native navigation only. No need other libraries. It is pure native. Then uh, go to index file. Then you have to register your screens and set your initial screen i set intro screen and uh, register with app launch listener this is the navigation navigation react native navigation function then go to src folder and uh, in this folder i create a sas component config and screen go to config folder in the config folder we have route and navigation so go to route folder we create register screen function and uh, uh, register our every screen with the react native navigation using register component and uh, initialize initialize their keys you can see you can set key anything now go to navigation we create uh, two function go to auth stack and go to home stack in the home stack uh, we create uh, login screen and uh, set their status bar color and top bar color and the layout orientation portrait mode in the go to home we create a drawer side menu and uh, create a bottom tab in the bottom tab uh, first uh, you need to create your stack home stack and uh, set your component name and uh, in the option you have to set your bottom tab text color icon color and selected icon color and selected text color and you can also set your top bar color and uh, same logic is implement uh, on profile stack and setting stack then go to login screen sorry go to app intro screen so first you need to hide this splash screen in the use effect function when you click on done button this will navigate to go to auth and uh, this will go to login screen when you click on sign up button you have to use push function and pass the component id and the component name then sign up screen will open and then uh, when you click on login button then home screen is open for uh, for when you click on menu icon so you need to check the button id and uh, set your side menu to all smalls same same code is implemented in the profile screen and uh, setting screen now go to side menu side menu is uh, uh, component so we create a component we create into a component folder so you first we have to set the active tab and uh, so I set a home stack tab and uh, we use navigation button tab selector this will give you a response uh, which uh, tab is selected and uh, which tab is unselected so we create a switch case so when when tab 0 is selected then we set home stack when tab 1 is selected then we set profile stack then this is the ui part when you click on dashboard this will navigate to go home and when you click on user list then you have to pass the component id from the active tab and uh, for disable side menu so you have for that we have to set visibility on merge option 
and you have also passed the component ID. Same code we use on everything, every button like news, about and for logout function we just call a uh, go to auth function. So thank you so much for watching this video. In next video we continue with the Redux. So thank you so much.